Greetings, welcome back to the Sinking City and I have an idea, let's go back to the Brutus home before we go check uh, the hospital and let's ask Brutus about the shot woman it seems like it's gonna be a whole lot easier than trying to search for whatever we don't know in the whole house with so many people around that we cannot talk with, but we can talk to Brutus. Funny yeah. Thing. I found a dead woman in your basement. Now I don't suppose you had your men kill her. Quiet, you! You're scaring Mary. Look, she didn't die by my order, kid. Take my word for it. And the guilty have already been severely punished. Look, I have my shortcomings, but I don't hurt women or kids. Okay. Bye. And now we have all evidence collected. This is all I wanted to get. <laughs> really? Okay, if... If I have his word that he doesn't hurt women or children, then let's say he's gonna be a better man. I don't know. can tell I would be horrible detective. Just having all the clues in front of my eyes. Listening to every testimony possible, I'm still gonna make wrong decisions, so... Let's just stick to it, I guess. There's, let's say there's no bad decision. Decisions. Or something. I don't know. I really feel bad about Georgie, that's all. Hello? No, I, yes, I have. Do I? No. We don't have any free beds left. Yes, I know, I'm just looking for a man with... Wait, am I supposed to go? Okay. Let's see about that. Let, let's visit the archive first. <sighs> nope. Nope. No. Do I have... Yeah, no, I have to write. This one. <laughs> and who was on shift was woke up in the crematory suffering from a head injury. Patience. It was in the read... read no, it wasn't Rita Heights for a hood. Which this would was that? It was Rita Heights. Rita Heights. Period. No, subject patients and I think therapy? Surgery? Not that one. After the flood. God damn it. Hmm. James one of the men who was on shift who woke up in the suffering from a head injury and requires urgent treatment. Oh, it's like that. Mm, diagnosis head trauma, concussion, treatment, hospitalized. Hospitalized. Second floor of Oakman's. Yeah. Wait, second floor of this one? I suppose. First floor. And second floor. Okay, is there anyone who looks like in her? To I no, it's not you, for sure. Not her. Well, can we talk? We cannot talk. Wait, what? Am I wrong place? Mars Hospital. Bed rest recommended. I am in this hospital, right? Oh, it's like this. Okay, so we are on the second floor right now. You. You're James Warren, right? Yeah, that's me. What do you want? I'm sick, can't you see? 
Or we could go a group of people brought an unconscious man to the crematorium. I need to know who those people were. What makes you think I'd know that? You were supposed to cremate a man listed as Jack White. He escaped, and now he wants to know what's going on. So tell me, who paid you to burn a man alive? How do you know about White? I talked to him. I need names, Warren. Uh, I can't. <laughs> I say anything. I'm toast. They'll certainly kill you if they find out Jack White is still alive. I can arrange that. No, please. No, I, I didn't ask their names. They're priests, but they ain't from St. Michael's Church, that's for sure. They were talking about the Lord of the Woods or something. Maybe from an old Oakmont church? That's all I know, I swear. Where can I find this church? I don't know. Some things in this Borg are best left alone. It's not much, but thanks. Wasn't that hard after all, was it? You got what you came for. Now leave me be. Not really useful, are you? Let's see. The men who brought Brutus to the crematorium were most likely parishioners of one of the Oakmont's churches. One says the men mentioned a lot of the woods. That gives me nothing. Okay. Church goers wanted Brutus to be cremated. Okay. What can we do about that? Do we go back to Brutus? Let's see, we don't know. Oh, okay, we can go to the manor. Okay, so we'll delete that. Where's the manor? Oh, okay, it's right. It's next to the Fogmorton's manor. Okay, I guess we're gonna meet the Pelkanger. Won't be. Well, hopefully he won't be tough, <laughs> because I don't want to waste a, a lot of bullets on him, that's for sure. Now, uh, I have to go here, and I oh, never mind, I thought this was his manner because I thought it was white, no white, no, actually, is that it? The Carpenter family offers food and medicine between 9 a.m. and 5 p.m. each day, one piece per person. And no one show, uh, showed up. Guess. Oh. What's happened? What's happening? Hey, oh. hey you. No loitering. Only workers are permitted on the premises. You're handing out supplies for free. That seems awful charitable. Mr. Carpenter is a pillar of our community, generously donating half of our supplies to the people of Oakmont in their time of need. I'm looking for work. I heard you might have a job. Sure. There's a sack of potatoes in the basement of the manor. Go get it. Bring it here, okay? Got it. Get a move on there. Okay, and he... <laughs> Take some medicine. Thank you. You're welcome. I suppose I can't Bye. carry anymore. No. Got myself. Eh? First aid kit. Okay. No. <laughs> of course. How can you not? Connect that they're nearly burnt Brutus alive with him being charitable. Okay. Wait, can we talk? <laughs> Not so fast, newcomer. You ain't going upstairs unless the boss calls for you. Okay. They look like some kind of... ...in small... I don't know, like in small first before being blessed by the sea, something like that. 
Do I actually have to... No? It's sold. Maybe that's why. I'm looking for potatoes. Coal. Potatoes, okay. It's right around here. There's no more left. So, where are the potatoes? Really? Okay. Probably want me to ask someone where are the where are the potatoes, don't you? Don't you have work to do? Hmm. Oh. Yesterday no. we're beating up newcomers. Today we're high. No, we don't want we don't want me to talk. Some more there? No, there was I found nothing. Here? No, it's outside, okay. Oh, great. What? You really want me to go look? Okay. Did the way. Oh, I missed, I missed. Hello, do you need any help? Ah, please, friend. Don't take away my food. Your food? This is stolen. This sack was meant to go to the hungry. We are the hungry, mister. Me and my family. I have five children to feed and nothing to feed them with. Oh, look, we'll starve to death without it. Have a heart. I don't get it. You can have food for free. The carpenters are distributing it. So why steal? They'd only give me one portion. Even though I told them that my wife and kids are too weak to get here. <sighs> don't worry. I... I get it. Look, uh... Hang on to the sack for now. I'll try to work something out for you. Okay? Oh... Oh, thank you, mister. K bless you. You're a lifesaver. Just don't go anywhere. I'll be back soon. Can we take some empty sack? No. Can we take the empty sack from the potato shack and fill it with coal? Hmm. How are you planning to get back there? Okay, and they're still waiting. Some people from here, nothing. Stop it. There's a, a minor issue. What? what? What issue? Oh, the sack was stolen by one of your. No! Workers. I tracked him down, so he's not going anywhere. But I'm trying to decide. What about choice? Damn thieves! May I take them? I'm sure your boss would want to know about it. But I can see you're pretty oh. busy. Oh. Tell you what, I'll go talk to him for you. Uh, you're right. I'm needed here. Vera, go see Mr. Graham Carpenter and report the incident. He's upstairs. Thanks. <laughs> and where exactly? Oh, here? Mr. Carpenter? Yes. Oh. Um, Carpenter. How can I help? One of your workers is a thief. Stole a sack of potatoes. Oh. I do hope my people haven't taken it into their own hands. Not yet. Is, is there a way to solve this peacefully? He has a hungry family. That's why he stole. I won't punish a man for trying to feed his family. Why didn't he simply ask me for more food? Tell him he can keep what he stole. 
If he needs more, let him come back. It may be that he'll need medicine, too. Can you give him this? It's not much, but it'll help. No offense, but why such generosity all of a sudden? I mean, this distribution of supplies. I hope to set an example for the other influential families of Oakmont. Together we can make our city a better place. Besides, after the incident with the poisoned fish, people were left with nothing to eat. I had to take action to prevent starvation. Thank you. I thought Brutus was the head of the Carpenter family. Something changed? Oh, uh, no, not at all. My father's still in charge. I've simply taken on some of his responsibilities. He's past his prime and needs more rest. Mask? Why do you wear it? A war wound. I prefer not to discuss it, if you don't mind. Goodbye. Hmm. Okay, so maybe that's why his people for his people him. What I don't know what to think about that. Oh, sorry, because he's telling me that his son. Face before. Yes, Georgie. Paris, December 1918. Right after the guns stopped firing. Okay, so it might be the war wound. Yeah, you don't get these for staying in your foxhole. He might be telling the truth. But that that means that the doppelganger isn't real. Don't let Papa Brute have the keys to the room. He's already lost them twice around the house. Whoa, those are creepy. You want me to go downstairs, don't you? Okay. Where? Somewhere there? Oh! The main o I didn't see that! Interesting. Hello. It doesn't look like the Brutus. The fuck? Now, weren't you the one who called Robert an ape lover, Brutus? What the hell is going on here? This is an unexpected turn of events. I'm on the verge of complete rejuvenation. Frankly, I didn't expect the flock of this age-old church to still exist, let alone assist on my quest. Perhaps this high priest merely feigns disgust of at our family pro proclivities, or perhaps he finally understands why I must prolong my existence. Regardless, all that remains is to meet with him. The cost is irre irrelevant, for out of all of Oakmont, I alone deserve eternal life. Tomorrow, tomorrow, the city will meet a new young Brutus Carpenter. This means you? Brutus Carpenter, I presume. Yes, that's right. Did you bring me something to eat? I'm very hungry. Um, no, sorry. Ah, well, move on then. Bye. Now that's interesting. Okay, so. Okay, I'll stick with the other one. The other one is real. Graham wants to change his family, they're helping poor. Graham's brave enough to go against the family's traditions. He really wants to change things for better. But this must the priest of an old church. All the evidence leads to an old Oakman church that worshipped the Lord of the Woods. Maybe some history books could shed light on which church it is. That might be it. 
So we're going to the library now. Library is here. Okay, I'll just go like that. And this one will delete. Wait. I was told I found all the evidence, so... Why is it yellow? It should be green. Can I talk to... Rufus? No, apparently everything's fine. Let's try to smart brute. Interesting. Can I look at the map? Nope. Hmm. Can we bring him something to... I hate that painting. Oh. This has been empty for years. <laughs> Seems someone believes eternal life comes in a bottle. He found one of the books, didn't he? He create, created himself a doppelganger. And there's nothing left to find here. Hmm, there's something written. God damn it. No, I can't quite make it. Foy Hayden? They Hayden? I don't know. I tell which district in there it is. One. Okay, that's the. So we're looking at this. Huh. Somewhere in this district. No, not. No, it's. Ah, it's annoying that I have to go back here. Somewhere here, I think it's this house. Somewhere between this house and the other. Because. I think, yeah, that's the thing. Like, it's two blocks. No, it's. Yes, this is the house right under the. This, so this is the house. This is the block. Okay. I'll check it out. Do you want to talk now? No. Hmm. Basement. I think. Oh no, we visited the basement after all. Can you really not take the empty sack of potatoes and fill it with coal? Oh no, I guess not. <laughs> after I said it, I noticed how bad of an idea it was. Oh, there's another level. And I can't destroy those. Hmm. No, okay. I had to check, okay? I just had to. But really no one's concerned that the Bru that Brutus is young? Younger, I should. Wait, why is this? Why is this red? Oh, probably that's why. <laughs> really, nothing else interesting really to you. Don't you have work to do? I'm doing my work, looking for clues. Promptly. There's no other clue I can find around here. Or, uh, or unless. Can I finally check this out? No. Hmm. Yesterday we're beating up. No. Today we're high. 
Because what's going to happen tomorrow? I'll kill for a good fight. <laughs> oh, maybe something in the shed? Definitely not. But I'll get too far in or I might get stuck. Who would put such a statue outside? Isn't it worth a fortune? Okay. Once again, I'm pretty sure we can find the, all the evidence. I'm sure of that. No one wants to talk to me about anything. Okay, give me a second and I'll be back. I knew I missed something. Letter from Boston. Dear Graham, I was very glad to receive your last letter and I appreciate that you are worried about me. I want to thank you once more for saving my life in that battle. I'm sorry about what happened to your face. You could have just left me there dying, but you didn't. I'm forever in your debt. Jones. And that's still it's all. Okay. So we know that Graham is telling the truth. In every everything he said to us was confirmed somehow so now okay I, now we're supposed to go to the library and i still have that one block marked that one that was marked on the map in brutus doppelganger room i don't know is there any quick way to go there we could actually go there oh that's interesting Okay, so first things first, the library, because we're looking for something, I don't remember what. Really don't remember what. What are we looking for? Huh? Oh, well, we'll see. It's really new. No, no, no. What are we looking for? Live and see the old moon. Oh, church. Okay, we're looking for church. Now it makes a little bit of sense. Oh, I hate windows. I always feel that there's gonna be a cutscene. Let's see. Oh, she's got suffering. Nope. Nope. Last testimony. This one. History books. Maybe. Uh, no. Modern, I think. Local? Another prominent Oakland place of worship was the Redemption Church. Its flock venerated Kay as the Lord of the Woods, the Shepherd of Lost Lambs. Redemption Church was at one time the city's largest congregation, but its influence dwindled after St. Michael's Church of the Burning Bash was founded. Redemption Church still stands in Central Salvation Arbor on Marsh Avenue between Polaris Road and Old Church Road. We have been there. Yep. And in Salvation Harbor. That's not the right thing. It's here. Yeah, it's here. <laughs> There's no there is no real reason to mark it down. So it'll be right next to the phone booth. Let's go there and uh, maybe you will finally get to talk to someone in church. For, for, as far as I remember, there was both churches were empty, if I remember correctly. Hmm. We'll see. If only to load up. Thank you. I'm sorry about that. Where's the entrance? Am I at the right spot? Yes, I am. It's right here. It would actually it would be very interesting to find someone in Oh it's closed. Hello. I remember entering here. I don't know why it was closed now. So. Of course. Anything else? Oh god damn it. 
Oh my god, no, 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 my sanity, my sanity. I don't know what happened. Come over here, come here. The other one there as well. Okay. Frank's okay. What did you see there to make you go crazy like that? Okay, no wonder you went crazy. Oh no. Okay. How many illusions are there? Oh, no, that's gonna be horrible, right? Okay. Oh, I guess the altar was the worst one. And this one's left the basement. Wait, do I have any? I have three knowledge points left to distribute. I don't know why I'm why I'm not doing that. No, the wrong one. This is where I wanna be. Do something from shotgun, some machine gun, battle rifle. No, so let's go with that. This range, I don't need that. Give me that. Oh, what's up? Hilda failed to seduce the mayor with promises of eternal life. Now we need some mercury spilled in his bedroom to make our proposal more attractive. Damn. Don't you think that's pretty extreme? Oh, it's just you. Oh, come over here. Something's chewed this one up real bad. I burned the seductive witch, my daughter, my cursed seed, but she came back. How long will the Almighty test my faith? She is here, laughing at my weakness. Her body is not hers anymore. It is the filthy goat's womb, the breeder of the devil's, devil's spawn. She is mine. My blood, my treasure. How neither of the div devil nor filthy man may touch her. For I have smitten her sinful flesh, mixed her beautiful with dust. Mixed her beauty with, the, with dust. How could it be? How? She came back, born by the sinful hole her body turned to. She whispers to me, promising we'll be together, always. They hung me, their fathers, but not for long. That night I was born again by my dear daughter. Damn, you're crazy. I don't wanna go down there. I, thought I don't wanna go down there. Cause I have... I have a bad feeling what's going what I'm gonna find. No. This is in good shape and ready to use. I don't want to use this it. Is in good shape and ready to use. Okay, I guess I don't have to use it. I hope I don't have to use it. Hmm. I need to find something else. What's that? Our devoted members in the police department attract two more officers to our ranks. We must prepare them for a meeting with our fecund mother, the great daughter of the Lord of the Woods.
Oh no, okay. Make sure you get every scrap. We don't want anyone reading these while we're down there. Okay. Like okay, not the goddess K. <laughs> the crematorium. We'll destroy them before we die. Hmm. Don't wait. I'll catch up to you. Oh. That's not all. There's nothing down here for sure. I don't see anything else. Is it upstairs? Yeah. The stars are aligned, and a new turn of the cycle begins. The time has come to return to the mother's womb, and we shall be reborn. Brothers and sisters, let's get a handle on what actually happened here. This stars are aligned, and a new turn of the cycle. No, I actually, the time has come to return to the mother's womb. Make sure you get every scrap. We don't want anyone reading these while we're down there. Wait, what? Take them to the crematorium. We'll destroy. Them See that? Don't wait. I'll catch up to you. Group of fanatics based in the Redemption Church. Got rid of several bodies, took all the documents they could, and dived. Okay. Uh -huh. Oh no. Who's not taken away? It's called Mother Church. The records taken by the cultists are my only hope of discovering who betrayed Brutus. Yeah, damn it. Okay. You know that? But you know what? I'm gonna do that in a while. I have to prepare myself first. For now, thank you very much. Bye bye!